in this matchup for Guy is not horrible, but definitely the Samian punch is the... Yeah, the, the, and I feel yeah. like it's just like, when you look at the like the risk reward, because if you're going with Punish, would stand strong into like the, the slide. Combo, yeah. Or, or target oh, combo, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Like, it's better than just getting like the stand medium kick. Mm -hmm. You know, and plus you'll probably lose to all Vega's buttons, so. Oh, yeah. Now, the only thing Stan Kick is good for is I could gain over the Crouch Medium Kick from Vega. Oh, yeah. So, uh, yeah, for, like, situations like that. There we go. Okay. Marcos, though, gets get some damage, pushing him back to the corner slowly, but doesn't matter. He's dragging. Pressure. Oh, he right. finds it. And see, he just gets in with that. Like, there's really not much Vega can do at that oh. point. Sadly, he missed that overhead conversion afterwards, and Marcos is able to find Tempo back because of it. Oh, here we go. Jeff has all this meter. Oh, okay. Oh. He doesn't need it. He's about to do some work. Can he find it? Can he find it? Doesn't wow. want a combo. Wants to throw him instead. Yeah, no, he keeps going for that. He did, <laughs> uh, I believe, two times in a row when he got the knockdown pressure. This crouch light kick, going for a tick throw. Both times. Hey, man, it works. You can't knock it. Now, despite what we just saw, I do want to call out Tio Blanco. He could do really great spacing with the Vega normals. Not giving G-Drag a good chance to get those counter pokes. Yep. But, but uh, pressure. He's getting in too easy. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's making it hard for Marcos. I mean, because, like, especially oh. since. The oh, my. <laughs> Whoa. I mean, that was still an American oh. reset, but he still had that first counter hit set up with that uh, stand medium kick. Yeah. That was good. Marcos shaking his hands, saying, wow, I need to heat my fingers up. I need to heat my fingers up. Stick. Oh, the stand medium punch. Stand medium punch. That. Oh, the option selects. Very close to stun, oh, actually. No. You know what? I think he's on tilt right now. I think we're going to see it perfect. Oh. I think we're going to see it perfect. Is that, I don't know if he could do it perfect. He's going to get that reset. Oh, my. <laughs> what? Boom. Boom. G oh, Dragon straight going styling. Super Saiyan in the house. You that can't was, believe. That was very, that was very good. You know what? Tio Blanco looking strong, coming right back, getting his own pressure going, gets some great solid hits, and an uphill bow now for G Dragon. Oh my god, great uh, car throw. Tio saying, all right, my hood perfect is in here. Well, it's oh, not, it's not yeah. that hood anymore. I yeah, it'll fly, yeah. too much. Uh, uh, oh! Okay. There we go. That's a good challenge. He's recognizing. It's like, okay, can't keep letting him get in like this. Because then he's get, then he's in the face, and Marco then I lose. 180 that round. Got perfect. Came back. He's like, no, no. I am Vega. Let me show you Vega things. I don't know what Vega things are, but I don't know. Air throws. Like <laughs> Air throws. Vega looks kind of interesting in Street Fighter Five, man. Yeah, yeah. Like he looks like fun. <laughs> oh my God. Is that a cross-up? And you get thrown back in the corner because you're facing Guy. Oh, no. Ooh. Okay. Oh, my. What? Things happened. That was a uh, very interesting conversion there. There's that Sam medium kick against the crouch medium kick. Yeah. And seeing, like, in situations like this where he has, like, such a better life lead, he used to have a, such a better life lead, you know, it's Control. a good trick. Yeah, it's good for spacing. And oh. High burn meter, yeah. Oh. That's it, yo. Oh. That jumping. Just misspaced it, and Marco Shelby at the same time just took his claw and was like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what his face looked like when he did it. Mm -hmm. You should have heard Marco scream really loud. Definitely ready? happened. Yes. <laughs> I guess Marco's he's a screamer. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so here we go. Backflips. Dude, once again, no. With a very good starting pressure, just keeping it going. And, oh, sadly, G-Dragon doesn't take the corner. You know, Marcus is really turning this around. He, he's he's the one keeping the pressure. He's the one poking him out. Yeah, and he can join the airspace now as well and gain the poke to neutral game. Oh, no. Ooh. Oh. oh fucks up that uh, run stop right there. See, it's going to be hard to get in now. Because, yeah, he, I, Marcos would be willing to trade with anything at that point. It's like... And G Dragon not in his head because that was his third unsafe slide that round. So yeah. really uh, just overextending himself with that slide and misspacing it. Because if you hit with the very tip, it can be safe. Oh, it has to be go. just the tip. Hey, just the tip. You're right. No conversion off the overhead. Puts himself in the corner. Marco stoles him out. And then hits him up to the ceiling. 
Good damage. Oh, once again, the unsafe slides. He, he, he keeps going so to that. much. And it just shows how just nervous he's feeling now in the neutral game since Marco's starting to hit these, you know, control it more. He's trying to just go for these risky slides and they're not working. Oh, and he gets and, done. And that's probably it. Yeah, the yeah. going for max damage. Well, you know, it happens. You let Marcos get momentum. He's really feeling himself. He's like, all right, I'm going to get you with these frame traps, get you with these car throws. He, he figured Back out the Backflip, throw you on the wall. <laughs>